The holidays are in full swing, and that means lots of fun on your agenda, but sometimes the fun turns into slump. WDSU medical editor Dr. Corey Bear joins us with how to be merry and festive while keeping your family safe. That's in today's weekend house call. The holidays are always great times to spend with your family. However, as a physician, I've unfortunately seen some bad outcomes when people are supposed to be celebrating. This actually may scare the daylights out of you, but it's my duty. You can still enjoy a very glorious holiday season and avoid a tragedy by simply paying extra attention to the ones you love the most. Children are at increased risk because of the decreased awareness of their presence. When people are trimming their trees, their small ornaments, broken ornaments, and small light bulbs that are just waiting for a young, unsuspecting child to put such a thing in their mouths. In the ER, I've had to surgically remove ornament hooks from the windpipes of small children. And that tree sitting proudly in your living room right now, although very beautiful, can also be a hazard. Make sure to keep your Christmas tree moist and watered at all times. You must remember that there are electrical wires running through that tree, and if the tree is dry and brittle, it becomes a fire hazard. I want everyone that is watching this right now to pause and go check your smoke detector and your carbon monoxide detector. We never check these detectors because we forget about them. It's very important that you check your carbon monoxide detector because at this time of the year, you're usually using your heater. If your heater malfunctions, it can emit carbon monoxide, and that's an odorless gas that can kill you. Because of all the fire hazards associated with Christmas trees, Christmas lights, and lit menorah candles, thousands of people will lose their homes due to fires this holiday season. It's very important that you keep your carbon monoxide and smoke detector in tip-top working shape. Holly berries, mistletoe berries, and poinsettias are also toxic. Be careful to make sure that neither children nor pets eat these poisonous plants. Don't leave alcoholic drinks unattended. Alcoholic eggnog, alcoholic cider, and many other drinks look very appetizing to young children. Please remember that it doesn't take a lot of alcohol to inebriate a child, and in some severe circumstances, acute alcohol poisoning can occur. And one last thing. If I hear about another person that's trying to fry a turkey for the first time on the day that you're trying to eat it, I'm going to scream. If you want to fry a turkey for the first time Christmas Day, please make sure you start taking lessons or classes today. I'm Dr. Corey Bear with your Weekend House Call.